Good evening, everyone. I'm Rob Wood. I'm Christy Casciano. We continue to follow developing news tonight. More than $13,000 has been raised for the man who had water dumped on him at a Syracuse Dunkin' store. The video has gone viral, and now the community is rallying together to help Jeremy Dufresne. News Channel 9's Josh Martin is live tonight to tell us more about those efforts. Josh. The community has just been so generous in helping Jeremy Dufresne. I talked to the person who's organizing the GoFundMe. The goal was just $150, trying to get him some new clothes or some help in that way. But now that the money is so large, over $13,000, getting the money to Jeremy may be a little complicated. The goal was only $150, but now more than $13,000 has been raised for Jeremy Dufresne. Good conversation yesterday about helping, you know, and he, he has a beautiful heart, but he's okay. He's relaxing. He's with his auntie, and, um, and he's moving forward. That money will go directly to Dufresne, who is homeless and who has disabilities. But it's how that money will be handed off that presents a challenge to those behind the effort to keep Dufresne in recovery. They want to make sure it's done right. Right now, he's kind of just listening. I asked him, like, what do you want? Instead of trying to pigeonhole him and tell him what we think he needs, I asked him, what do you want to happen? What do you want to go down now that this is all out there? And he doesn't have an answer. He doesn't know what he wants. We know Dufresne met with Syracuse police earlier this afternoon to discuss possible charges against the Dunkin' Donuts employees. Those close to him say he's been staying with family. He'll be meeting with community advocates later this week. And members of the Dunkin' Donuts Corporation have met with those community advocates already. They met this morning. They talked about ways to better improve their training to help handle situations like the one that happened earlier this weekend, to better handle those and take care of them in a better way. Live in Syracuse, Josh Martin, News Channel 9. Josh.